Today we will introduce how to convert the point cloud from relative coordinates to absolute coordinates with GCP Optimize. Before processing GCP, it is necessary to prepare the task that have been processed in relative coordinates and control point file. We can see now the point cloud is in relative coordinate. Check the GCP Optimize box in the SLAM process module, the software automatically loads the control points that we collected during data acquisition. Click on the top left corner to load the reference point file. Note that X is the east coordinate and Y is the north coordinate. Then click apply. We can see the course alignment error between the reference point and the point to be aligned. This error is a computational error based on the rigid transformation and is for reference only. For control points that are far away, or whose accuracy is disputed, we can delete them with the delete button. For example the point P9, we assume it's not precise enough. Then select it and click the delete button to remove it. If you have missed a control point during the acquisition, or if you need to add a point to improve the accuracy of the coordinates, you can use the add point function to add a new point. Let's add the control points we just deleted. We can pick up this point on the point cloud. Rename it. Then enter its exact coordinates. Click on Accept GCP button, click OK. When it's completed, we can check with the Pick Point tool, now the point cloud is in absolute coordinates. If we are not satisfied with the GCP results, for example, if the X and Y coordinates have been entered backwards, or if there is a problem with the coordinate values of the input points. We can use reset project function to restore the point cloud to what it was before doing the GCP. Now the point cloud is again reduced to the relative coordinate system.